Hey guys, welcome back to Inspiratic. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a custom ringtone or alarm for your iPhone. So the three apps that you'll want is GarageBand, which you can get from the App Store for free, and then Settings, which you definitely should have already, and then Files, which you also should already have. And then the first thing you're going to want to do is save a sound that you want as your alarm or ringtone to your um, camera roll and you can just screen record a sound and then the second thing is um, you'll want to go to Google or Safari then go to audio extractor and then click on the first thing that pops up then press iPhone ringtone go to open video photo library go to the video that you want as your alarm or ringtone press choose Wait for it to compress. And then wait for it to load. Okay, now that it's loaded, press extract audio, extract audio, sorry. And then press download. Download again. Files. And then find the audio that you just extracted. And then once you find it, um, hold down on it until this pops up. And then press rename. Oh, oops, I pressed the wrong thing. Press rename. And then I'm just gonna do it, I'm just gonna call it alarm, I guess. Funny alarm, I don't know. <laughs> okay, and then now you know what name it's gonna be. So then, go out of both of those things and then go to GarageBand press p the plus and then there's a bunch of things here but go to audio recorder and press voice then go to little bricks on the left hand upper corner I don't really know what it's really called but that's what it looks like and then once that pops up go to the right hand upper corner and press the little loop then go to files, um, press browse items from the file app, and then press the thing that you just um, extracted, press on it, and then wait for it to load. Okay, now it's there, hold on it until this pops up, and then go to the thing and um, like put it in the sound thing. And then go to little tiny plus on the right hand upper corner to change the um, length that you want. So I'm going to make it a little bit longer. And then once you've got that, um, press the little down arrow on the left hand upper corner. Go to my songs. And then hold down on the thing that you just did. Press rename. I'm just going to rename it the same thing that I did in files. And then now that it's there and named you're gonna hold down on it and then go to the bottom and press share and then press the middle thing as a ringtone then press continue and then export and then press ok and then go to settings Press sounds and haptics, then go to ringtone, and then it should be there. And if you have any questions or something didn't work for you, make sure to leave it in the comments and I hopefully will be able to answer it. See you next time.